Okay, let's see how this works. Uh, on the home screen now with the new Snapchat update, you can pinch and zoom out just like you would on a photo. And then it'll show you a little demo of seeing the world, how you can choose who can see your location on the map. Only me, only my friends, or you can select specific friends. So I'll just choose my friends for now, which includes obviously people that you might add in the future. Next. Finish. That's it. There we go. Now I can see where Robert is. He's the only one who's already updated, I guess, with the new update. So, let's see. If I zoom out. Oh, oh no, those are events. So, those are people who are sharing their location publicly. And. Snapchat stories, Ario Speedwagon. Who knew? <laughs> so this actually has potential to be interesting, and they've done it in a nicer way than, say, something like Periscope, I think. It just looks nicer. Blue Jays versus Rangers. Let's see what's going on there. This is from 19 hours ago. Oh, yeah. Yeah, just a collection. No, they don't. Collection of stories. Swipe down to make it go away. Lots of baseball. Snapchat must be big with baseball, folks. Going all over the world. Anybody awake in Australia? Nobody in New Zealand? <laughs> you suck us! You suck us! All right. Tap the gear up here and you can change your settings. So ghost mode would mean nobody can see your location. So, cool. Back to the home screen. There we are. Quick update on location sharing in Snapchat. See ya.